In the beginning, reads the story of Genesis, after God declared, let there be light. After creating the heavens and the earth and all the glories therein, he created people, patterned after himself as keepers and caretakers over all the earth and all living things. In that opening scene, the 29th verse, God said, I give you every seed-bearing plant on the face of the whole earth and every tree that has fruit and seed in it. They will be yours for food. And to all living things, everything that has the breath of life in it, I give every green plant for food, and it was so. His very spark of life, breathed into the dust, became alive in this world. And the pattern was set for sustaining that life, transferred from one form to another by the consumption of living food. Yet, with time and civilization, the simplicity of God's system was lost. The understanding of nutrition and health became confused, and the delicate balance of passing on life through whole, living foods forgotten. This is a call to remember. Life comes from life, and feeding on that which is dead cannot sustain life in the way that we were designed in the beginning. Join us now as we hear the wisdom we once knew. Your heart and your health can be restored by the renewing of your mind.